and welcome back to our survival let's play on Jack Pine. FS22 is out. It's been out for what we had six days now. Um, I haven't been on Jack Pine for well longer than that. Um, and I think, in fact, it'll be over a week because just before FS22 came out, I was putting the hours into Greenlands to get that series finished. I've kind of made a decision on what's going to happen with this. Um, we are going to go through one more cycle, but there's some caveats to it, and I'll show that when we get to the um, when we get down to the farm. By cycle, I mean past um, the next harvest. First thing we're going to do, though, is we're going to sell this windrower. I've already sold our... Um, our mows off. I'll show you on here. Um, so you'll see sold vehicles there, 142,000. Um, I might as well just tell you now. Sold animals, all our pigs have gone. All 150 of them. Um, so we no longer have pigs. Um, sold buildings, I think that was the pressure. In fact, I don't think it was definitely the pressure washer. Property income, we know about. Um, what's that? Our oh, harvest income. I sold all our corn. I was really disappointed by the uh, corn harvest. Really, really disappointed. 47 grand for everything we had. Obviously, we missed the peak. Um, I mean, I think I was about, well, over £100 per thousand litres down compared to what it should have been. Uh, and that's been an issue on this map. I've never... It doesn't matter what it is, I've never been able to hit, hit peak price for anything. It always says it's the next day, and then when it comes to the next day, it plummets. Right, we're going to sell this. we repair that first, 470,000. The reason we've sold that is we no longer need... It's the amount of power that's in that... Um, we needed it for the hills. We've seen to that now, which I'll show you when we go over. Now what we need is, we need, we need, we need. I've just thought, would it be easier just to get that? Or do we still need a tractor and a, um, and a mower set up? Which would be this one, I think. So we'd need two hundred, at least two hundred ninety horsepower. Because I want to one that uh, wind draws as well. You see. What else do we need a tractor for? We don't, do we? Flatten the silage. Right, we get a tractor. Tractor in the moor. Um, I'd be very tempted by the vent, uh, the fent. Could always get the fast track back. Right, I know which one I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get that massive fent. We'll get this, the one thousand five year. Um, max, do we need max spec? No, we don't. We'll get wides where weights will be good because when we come to do the um, silage the second time round, we'll buy that and we will go into mowers and we'll buy these two. I don't know, I don't even know what that does. So, I said one of the reasons for getting rid of the Challenger was due to we didn't need as much power anymore. The other reasons were it doesn't have the 
front three point linkage which made it an absolute nightmare when it come to mowing so it had to go and to be honest the fact that it was articulated as well it just it made it difficult uh, right Ah, you need them down to change. I was going to change the widespread. But we don't even need this today. Um, the grass won't be ready. I'll show you what I've done when we get... I might even be able to show you once we get to the top, top of the hill. This episode, I'm not sure how long it's going to be. It's not going to be that long. I'm nearly done now. But I recorded loads of stuff that we've already done. Um... All the field work that we've done, selling of the pigs, selling of the corn. I'm not sure how much of that's going to be in, to be honest. But there will be only a couple of episodes of this left. Um, that's part of the reason why I got rid of the, the pigs and the chickens are going to go as well. Just so I'm not seen to them all the time. Right, so, it's not going to show up. All our fields, if we go on here, all our fields have been sown with sunflowers. However, <laughs> me coming straight off FS22 and playing on Elm Creek without seasons on. I've planted the sunflowers too early. They might fail to germinate. If they do, then they do, and we're not replanting them or anything like that. That's one of them things. We won't be harvesting them. If they don't, then we're going to just go through it until them are done. Um, as for the grass, that hill has now been fully, um, fully seeded with grass. So we sorted on that front as well. Um, fertiliser, a lot of it's been fertilised twice. I mean, you can see the original field there has now got two applications. Same here. They all need further applications on it. Um, the ones down here. But I'll do that again off camera. There's no point in doing it on camera. Uh, right, what else? I've done quite a bit. In fact, I've been on here for a good few hours before turning this on just to get just to get ready um, oh that's another thing I've done I'll put that here I've actually been using that I used that to um, the 4 or 5 to seed the grass so a lot of our smaller implements have gone things like the we had a small um, we had a small cedar, we had a small fertiliser, the, um, I can't even remember, the topper for the potatoes, the actual potato harvester, they've all gone. Um, that is going to get sold. You can see, and we're going to fast forward, in fact, I'll put it on 200 now. Um... All our silage is gone. Apart from this. Oh, it's gone. I was going to say there was one little bit there that wasn't removed, but it's gone now. So that's all gone as well. Um, that's going to be obviously refilled. What I'm going to do, though, when we get the first cut, I'm going to put the first cut in. But I'm not going to, um, I'm not going to sell that until we get everything in. And we'll sell it as a wanna. But, I mean, for those of you who haven't used this sort of system before to empty your pits it's absolutely ideal in a way it's better if you can get this sort of either closer or in front but the downside with that is then you can't or you struggle to dry through it but this um where are we at belts i'm going down i'm that used to playing fs22 now 
I couldn't even remember when I came on here how to get into our garage. I was looking for the menu, and I, uh, I couldn't find it. Right, so you can get these as well. I know some of you will already know this, but there might be one person who doesn't. So, them belts basically fit between there and there, so that picks it up, it goes along the belt, and you can make it as long as you want. Um, and they are absolutely ideal, and you don't have to do anything. I, in fact, you can turn, I can turn that off now. That was one turn off. Um, yeah, you uh, you can make it as long as you want, and it'll just carry on going. I had to move this once, and I, what I did was instead of buying an extra belt, which I might have to do for the for the last one, I got the. It came up to about here or something. It was picking up up to about here. So I used our wheel loader just to push the silage up towards the um, pickup. Um, so yeah, so that's done as well. So now basically what we're waiting for is um, to see how much we get paid out from the biogas. I can't exact, I can't remember how much we had. Did we have just under half a million litres or something? I really can't remember. We'll find out what we had. Um, then that's today's episode going to be done. We will then sort of keep fast forwarding. Um, I'll do it off camera. We'll fast forward. I'll get things like the fertilising of the fields done. Um, again, off camera. And then we'll only come back for things like the cut into the grass and hopefully the harvesting if those um, sunflowers don't fail to germinate we're basically a full sort of stage away so whether it's going to work or not I don't know it might be that as soon as it hits I think it's 10 degrees isn't it as soon as it hits 10 degrees they might sprout but then they might not we'll see what I could have done, I could have knocked seasons off, couldn't I, and just, um, then it would have worked then, but, it's one of them things, if they don't work, they don't work, and it, it didn't cost us too much money anyway, a full one of them, um, hoppers, I think it was only 440, to fill the cedar up, and I only did that a couple of times, right, so, this should be decent, I thought it'd be more than that, seven, I really, really thought it'd be more than that, that's pure disappointment in my voice. What was the price for that? Oh, are we on hard mode, aren't we? I don't feel as bad now then. Um, what am I looking at? Silage, 150. Yeah, I totally forgot we're on. We're playing hard mode. Right, that's not as bad then. So we'll leave this one here, um, and we'll come back when the grass is up. So thank you very much for watching and I'll see you again in the next one.